Hello, I am Dr. Peter Glowitzki from Mayo Clinic and this is a Society for Vascular Surgery briefing about lymphedema. Lymphedema is a chronic condition caused by blockages in the lymphatic system that carry tissue fluid through lymph vessels and lymph nodes. Lymphedema occurs most frequently in the legs and arms and the condition can be either due to abnormal development of the lymphatics or due to acquired blockages of the lymph system caused by infection, inflammation, invasion of the lymph nodes by malignant tumors, or due to radiation or surgical excision of lymph nodes performed to prevent or treat malignant diseases such as breast cancer or pelvic tumors. Patients with lymphedema usually present with painless swelling of a limb or limbs. Hardening or thickening of the skin may also develop, and recurring skin infections, so-called lymph angitis or cellulitis, may aggravate lymphedema. Infection and severe skin changes may lead to an advanced form of the disease called lymphostatic elephantiasis. Rarely, malignant tumors such as lymph angiosarcoma can also develop in patients with long-standing lymphedema. Chronic lymphedema is just one form of lymph swelling. Swelling can also develop because of blood clots in the veins, heart failure, thyroid problems, or kidney failure. The diagnosis of lymphedema can be established by lymphoscintigraphy, a study when a low-dose radioactive substance is injected under the skin to trace the flow of lymph fluid through lymphatic vessels and lymph nodes. Ultrasound is useful to exclude clots in the veins, while computed tomography or magnetic resonance imaging help to identify causes of lymphedema. Depending on the severity of lymphedema, treatment options may consist of lifestyle changes, compression bandages or garments, or physical therapy. Manual lymphatic drainage is a treatment that uses massage to help the weakened lymphatic system, while external compression pumps help movement of lymph through the body. A combination of these techniques is called complex decongestive physical therapy. Drugs rarely help to reduce swelling, but antibiotics play a major role in controlling infectious complications that may aggravate lymphedema. Surgery is rarely needed, but in selected patients liposuction, excision of the excess skin and subcutaneous tissue, or lymphatic microsurgery may be helpful. If you have chronic swelling of a limb, see your vascular surgeon. Vascular surgeons are experts in the evaluation, prevention, and treatment of lymphedema. To learn more about lymphedema and other vascular diseases, visit www.vascularweb.org.